hey what is up everyone this is somnath gowder from future coders from this video onwards we are going to start a course on html you will learn everything about html this course is for complete beginners you will be practicing the concepts you learn in this course by building simple portfolio project link to the playlist of this course is provided in the description box below make sure you check it and bookmark it so without wasting any time let's start learning about html In order to build a complete website there are three main legends who are like the pillars of a website uh, those are html css and javascript html defines the skeleton of a website as you can see in the illustration css adds the beauty to the website making it look nice to the eyes for example we can change colors and animations make the website responsive then comes the javascript brain of a website using javascript we can make the website respond to user actions for example when a user clicks on a button we can make the user log in or log out let's take a look at one uh, html example real time html example open up your browser google chrome search here for wikipedia inside wikipedia search for html as you can see there we have an article on html almost everything you see online in is actually written using html to illustrate this let's take one let's take a look at one example what i want you to do, uh, do is uh, right click on this uh, web page and click on inspect this will open up the elements tab as you can see what you are seeing over here is the html code for this website as you can see there are various uh, html tags as you can see you can expand them and uh, and explore them don't worry if you are not understanding any of these it's okay if since you are a complete beginners uh, it's okay if you don't understand anything but at the end of this course i promise you that you will be able to understand all of these things one more cool uh, trick I, which i want to show you here is I want you to I want you to right click on this HTML, click on inspect. It's gonna highlight the tag which is responsible for rendering this HTML heading. Open it up. As you can see, there we have the text which is actually being displayed over here. What I can actually do is I can change it. Let's say I'll change this to future coders and hit enter. As you can see, I just modified Wikipedia. However, uh, whatever you whatever the changes you make is actually local to your browser, local to your browser's copy of this page. If I refresh it, uh, it goes away. So, so let's uh, head back to our PPT over here. So, what actually HTML is? Uh, HTML stands for Hypertext Markup Language. It is the standard markup language for creating web pages. It describes the structure of a web page. As we already saw in the illustration, it describes the structure of a web page. Uh, it tells the browser how to display the content. Now, what do I mean by it tells the browser how to display the content? For example, here I am in a PowerPoint. I want this browser uh, world to be bold. What I can actually do is I can select this and click on this bold button that will make the text bold right as similar to that html is actually similar uh, except we will be using tags to tell the browser wha what and how uh, we can actually display the html contents all right uh, now let's start exploring html let's open let's head back to our desktop so HTML files are nothing more than a simple text files. So to start writing in HTML, you need nothing more than a simple text editor. So if you are if you are on Windows, open up your Notepad. If you are on Mac OS, open Text Edit. Since I am on Mac OS, I will open up my Text Edit. Before that, I will create a new folder on my desktop and rename it as HTML. All right. Now let's open up our Text Edit. 
uh, we'll create a new document all right there is uh, there we have our new document if you are on windows please make sure you open notepad all right so what i want you to do here is just type this is my first web page all right once you typed it uh, go to file and save it if you are on mac uh, choose the file format as web page html dot make sure it's in the extension dot html if you are on windows please make sure you uh, make the uh, file extension as html by default uh, windows i think windows it will save as dot txt but the extension should be html it is important all right i will rename this as my first web page all right there we have there we have created our first very first html document all right uh, let's open it up in order to like display uh, the contents of a website we don't have to upload this file to a server uh, connect it to a domain all that stuff is not necessary what we can do is uh, we can open it in a normal browser i will open up this uh, open this up in a normal browser by right clicking and open with google chrome as you can see there we have our first web page and as you can see our content is actually being displayed over here is so this was just an introduction to html this is how we can create web pages using html all right so congratulations there it is your first website and all it took was just few minutes all right so that's it for this video hope you enjoyed this tutorial if you haven't accessed the course playlist yet i will leave a link to the playlist in the description box below make sure you bookmark it and if you haven't liked this video please make sure you like it and subscribe to our channel so we'll be discussing more more and more about html we'll be exploring more about html in the next video so uh, we'll be learning more about html tags and their attributes so i will see you in the next video thank you for watching